Welcome to the EMCO Modular Overfill Prevention Valve installation video. Please be sure to read the installation instructions supplied with every OPV as a supplement to this video. Begin by unpacking the OPV and screwing together the top tube sections hand tight. Using fabric strap wrenches, tighten the joint to 75 foot-pounds. Repeat these steps for the bottom tube sections. Assemble the valve to the top and bottom tubes. Begin to tighten by hand and finish with fabric strap wrenches until 75 foot-pounds tight. The next step is to cut the top tube. To calculate the top tube height, measure from the OPV collar ceiling surface to the bottom of the tank. Then subtract the measurement of the 95% capacity dipstick reading from your tank chart. The result is measurement C, your top tube cut length. Linked in the description is an OPV cut length calculator. After calculating the top tube height, Measure from the 95% mark of the OPV to the top tube cut length and mark the tube. Cut the top tube using a hacksaw equipped with a fine tooth blade to ensure a straight, 90 degree cut. Deburr the end of the cut tube using a number 10 blade then attach the collar drill fixture. Using a 13 over 64 inch drill bit, drill through the top tube in the four places indicated by the drill fixture. Clear away any burrs from the newly cut holes with a fine hand file, then repeat with a 150 grit emery cloth. Make sure to clear away any sanding debris once finished. Remove the larger o-ring located at the top of the collar and liberally apply seal all to the bottom o-ring and collar surface. Push the collar into the top tube until the rivet holes are lined up. Use a hammer and the indent tool to countersink each rivet hole. Using only the factory supplied rivets, apply seal all to each rivet and fasten the drop tube to the collar with a handheld rivet gun. Do this for all four rivet holes. For the final step, Measure from the OPV ceiling surface to the bottom of the tank and subtract 5 inches. This is the overall OPV length. Measure from the top of the collar down the OPV and mark this length. Using a fine tooth hacksaw, cut the bottom tube. You are now ready to install your MCO Modular Overfill Prevention Valve into the tank.